Departing the Duluth Ship Canal is the Lee A. Trigurtha. The Lee A. Trigurtha was built as the USS Chihuahua in 1942 by the Bethlehem Shipbuilding and Dry Dock Company at Sparrows Point, Maryland. She measures 826 feet in length, 75 feet in width, and 39 feet in depth. She is powered by two uh, 4,000 horsepower, six-cylinder Rolls-Royce Bergen diesel engines, which give her a top speed of 15 knots or about 17 miles per hour. She is also equipped with bow and stern thrusters to aid her maneuverability in port. The Lee A. Trigurtha has 24 hatches on her deck, which open into five cargo holds located below deck. Each hatch covering measures 48 by 11 feet. She has a maximum carrying capacity of 29,300 tons. Above her deck is a 250-foot self-unloading boom, which allows her to unload her own cargo without the aid of shoreside equipment. The Lee A. Trigurtha is currently owned and operated by the Interlake Steamship Company of Northern Ireland. Trigurtha is named in honor of Mrs. Dorothy Lee Anderson Trigurtha, a wife of Interlake steamship owner Mr. Paul R. Trigurtha. The Trigurtha saw service during World War II as a U.S. Navy fleet tanker in several convoys. She sailed in the Atlantic and Pacific, earning two battle stars and the Navy Occupation Service Medal Asia, which are proudly displayed on the side of her pilot house. She earned one of those battle stars in March 1943 when her convoy was attacked by 17 German U-boats in the Atlantic. After the war, she was later acquired by the Cleveland Cliffs Steamship Company to be lengthened and converted for Great Lakes service by the American Shipbuilding Company in 1961. She received a new midsection and had her original midship superstructure and pilot house were moved. The Trigurtha is 80 years old and is one of the oldest vessels sailing on the Great Lakes. This is the first trip the Lee A. Trigurtha is making for the season. She underwent extensive upgrades and renovations while in layup. The Trigurtha is departing empty today and is heading to Marquette to load iron ore pellets. If you see crew on board, give them a big wave and wish them a safe voyage. Once again, this is the Lee A. Trigurtha. She was built in 1942. She is 826 feet long, and she is heading to Marquette today to, all, to load iron ore pellets.